Good day, YouTube. I hope you're all having a great day. Welcome to the fourth episode of FM22 Challenges, and where we are looking to save Norwich City from relegation with 10 games left. If you've missed the previous episodes, go check them out on the link above. Right, now that you've caught up, in today's episode we play a further two games, first against West Ham away and then Brighton at home, which is a must, must win game. If you are new to my channel and wish to watch more videos like this one and further content from Football Manager, then I would highly recommend you to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss any future videos. Right, let's get FM in. Who are we playing next? we got West Ham away. They're 10th in the league at the moment. Then we're going to play against Brighton. We're at home, they're 14th. That's a must win. Villa at home, tough. Leeds away, that's a must win, but I don't know how we're going to win that. Ninth, Wolves, 13th. Yeah, some tough games. Every game in Premiership is a tough one. How have we done since we've arrived here? We took over after they drew against Watford away and at home to Arsenal. Good results to be fair. And then we got a 2-1 win. We was losing 1-0 and came back and won it 2-1. We drew against Man City at home. Great result. That's great four points. That month was amazing. And then we drew against Brentford away. And then I think we got a bit cocky and we lost to Southampton. We went a bit more attacking compared to our conservative approach. I've been doing a little bit more research on tactics of the tactics I'm using and I want to go a little bit further on them see and see what we can produce. So I kind of want to make these wings kind of like get one forward but get one back to so attack and support on a wing and then on this side a fullback support and then wing attack. Yeah, so he kind of supporting around this area while he goes forward. He's attacking there while he's got a bit of support from the fullback. So that's quite wing orientated, whereas that's kind of wing and inner orientated. And because we've changed that, I want to put the box to box over here and make Gilmore just a attacking central midfielder. So you've got your defensive, you've got your box to box, and then you've got your centre midfielder attacker. So no playmaker. I want my team to work as a, a function and not just as an individual player trying to whip the ball around. Okay, so I just went away for a minute to quickly change things around so that you don't have to see that. I can just take you through it and why. So we've already gone through for positional and to kind of go more pressing, we're going to stay balanced and we can change that with them for game. And then in possession, we want to play a bit more narrow we want to uh, pass into space, play out of defence, uh, pass in directness, standard, and play it extremely high. And then, again, because it's pressing, counter press, play counter football, take uh, short kicks and distribute it to centre backs. And then we want to play a high defensive line and a uh, much higher line of engagement. So really, really pressuring them, putting the other team on the front foot. We're in our relegation battle. We need our players to step up and we need to pile that pressure. We need to go for the wins now. It's make or break. So to do that, instead of playing attacking football, we play in pressing football. And then obviously trigger press much more often and prevent short goalkeeper distribution. So getting them to kick the ball out, either rush in, making a mistake, giving us the ball back, or us for, uh, to try and win it in the middle uh, for our three centre mids. So that's what we're going to go for in our next game. So let's get cracking. I'm not nervous. I'm not nervous. I'm confident. Try something different. We tried our cautious approach. We tried to go a little bit more adventurous and we just sucked at defending. But now I'm hoping to pile the pressure on for opposition with pressing football. Let's, let's see. Come on, boys. We can do this. What do you reckon the score is going to be? You know what? I've just realised I haven't got the other skin up. It's because I had an issue with editor. It's been resolved now because obviously a new update came out. Editor wasn't working with how my game was saved. Ah, oh, penalty, you twat. Hanley. Of course it's a penalty. 
Yeah. Yeah, so I rebooted it and I I re so I uh, so I'm trying to concentrate on the game. I reinstalled editor and for game and they both work fine and I just haven't put skin on. It's early on. It's early on. Don't give up. No, it's all over. Oh dear. Haven't been in the game. West Ham's all over us. I mean, just that's just me looking for XG. Let's now go to the positive. So I've put shoot on site and I've gone positive on my play front. What I'm going to do is I'm going to change him over uh, to a winger now. Him as support. Him as attack. Him as support. Do you play for inverted? Kid as well. Support. Try that. It gives me kind of a back three with him pushing forward, him coming in, him attacking at wings there, with him like that, and him, yeah, just changing it around. Yep, show me something better in the second half. It's over. Three now. Three now. Well, it was always going to be a hard challenge. Always was. Come on, Pookie, you're off now, mate. Billy Gilmer's not having a great game now. Kenny McLean. Oh, nice bit of play. Sergeant. Oh. Sergeant or Sergeant? I'm going to persevere with this tactic, though. Oh, well. All right, let's move on. Next one. Right, 19th versus 15th, Norwich versus Brighton. We're at home. It's virtually a sellout. I mean, what, 26.814 of 27.359. You will also notice that I've brought back my skin. Now, we do use a blackout one. If you want to see more regarding the skin and how to get it, go check out the video above. So, last game didn't really pan out well for us. We're trying to play pressing football. We will see. We will see. I'm not going to change it up now. I think we've done enough changes. Next match only, always the opposition instructions. Team selection. Because we're playing pressing and we're playing it out to defense, I've made them both ball playing defenders. I know Hanley's not a ball playing defender. I am again, like I did in the last game, I'm thinking about changing that, but we'll, we'll see how they do. Byron, is that for right call? Oh yeah, uh, Timo Piku got injured uh, for five days. Getting no loss has been so bad for me. If Rashik is coming back, we really need him back. Wish me luck. Because, you know what, if we if we lose this, Leeds drew their last game. So we're now six points. We're six points away from safety. And we've got five games left. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I do like this skin. Do want to try other ones out. Come on, Norwich. Because if we win and Leeds lose, that's three points. That's how tight it could be but we need to get the win and we need to pray that Leeds lose nice it's Byram it's Gilmore oh why didn't you have a crack oh there you go sergeant come on and there you see there you go ball playing defender he passed the ball out to a winger uh wing back full back that's it Aaron's gone he's not even on attack yes 2-0 Get in. Yeah, it just started coming back as I was saying it, but we've we've been holding our own. All right, fifty third minute. Let's still attacking McAllister, Duffy. Ah, I brought one back. Oh, now it is. Now it is squeaky bum time. Damn, 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 damn. Gilmore, Sergeant. Oh, unlucky. They really putting us on pressure. Come on, just watching in time. Not speaking. Five minutes injury time. Uh-oh. Come on, come on, come on. Three minutes left. Two minutes left. One minute. Ten seconds. Yes. Three points. We're still in it. I don't even want to review that game. Started off so well for us and they just brought it right back. Oh, Leeds won. Still six points. Palace lost 3-0 to Brentford. Palace might get a draw there or even beat Brentford four games to go six points gap we're still in it we're still in it so I've got to go through this all again I was thinking oh this 
this series is over, but we are still in it. If you don't want to miss it, subscribe, hit that notification bell so we don't miss a thing. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. If you would like to watch more videos like this, please subscribe. And to be notified, click on the bell.